Hi, I'm Mark. Do you have some last minute shopping that you need to get done for a hacker? I've got a few gift ideas that I think they will absolutely love. This was an easy list for me to come up with because all I had to do was get out my laptop bag and find the, the few items that actually really helped complete my nerd life. And so I've got five fairly inexpensive gift ideas that are great for last minute shopping before the holidays or even before a birthday, something like that. Let's get started first off with portable charger. At less than $30, one of the best gifts you can give is an Anchor Power Core Fusion 5000, particularly for the mobile hacker. You can plug it into a wall and you get two USB outlets for charging. You can remove it from the wall and carry it in your laptop bag and it is a portable charger with enough juice to recharge a phone three times or two phones at once, uh, one and a half times, I guess. It includes a micro USB connector and cable so you can recharge the power core fusion itself off of a USB port like off of a laptop. Anchor is considered a de facto standard among hacker types. Nearly every InfoSec person I know that is remotely passionate about their portable charger owns an Anchor. A flash drive may seem corny, but number two on the list is at least interesting. The Kingston Digital Data Traveler Micro Duo USB Flash Drive is awesome. I mean, the name could be shortened, but it's awesome. Tech nerds will immediately recognize the Kingston name, and this tiny little drive holds 128 gig of data. On top of that is a dual hitter. It sports a USB Type-A plug on one end and a USB Type-C on the other. This means you can plug this into a lot of different devices and you can do fun tricks like transfer data between devices with different USB plugs. It is fast as it supports USB 3 and best of all, it is $40. Number three reflects the need for hacker speed. The Edimax AC1750 is a dual band Wi-Fi USB 3 adapter. It will work on Windows 10, Mac, and best of all, Linux. The only issues I have run into is making sure that you are on the latest drivers on Linux, but Linux users are used to that kind of thing, and it is so worth what little extra effort is required. The speed is insane, 2.4 gigahertz and 5 gigahertz supported. It talks 802.11ac, so basically it talks to anything. Uh, even better, I can reach networks further away. Always an appeal for the wily hacker on the go. Coming in at $50, I think this is one of the better bargains. Fourth on the list is a computer. Now, a great gift to give a computer nerd is, of course, a computer. Well, for less than $40, your hacker can get a computer that they can customize, play with, tweak, and otherwise have a blast with. So the fourth gift is a Raspberry Pi 3B+. Plus. Even if they already have a couple of these, they are still great gifts because there are so many projects that can be done with them. And any nerd will love to have another toy to wreak havoc with. I know many hackers have as many as a dozen of these, so don't worry. Fifth on the list is kind of a given since hackers need cables, but you should only give high quality cables. Now, I highly recommend anchor cables and get the ones with the nylon weave around the cable. As an avid techie, I've always had several USB cables in the laptop bag for various charging and data transfer needs. And I've always kept spares because most cables get worn out quickly, but not the anchor cables. The nylon ones are the ones that I get now and they seem to last and last and last. The other thing is get long cables. Six feet is a minimum length as far as I'm concerned. I mean, who designs a hotel room with an outlet so far away from the bed? 
I want to charge my phone while I'm in bed wasting time on social media instead of sleeping. I guess it's a bonus gift since many hacker types are going to be getting Amazon gift cards. One thing you could do is give the gift of Amazon Prime itself. Uh, this can be in the form of a three-month trial, it's around $40 if they already have Amazon Prime. Well, it just converts into a gift card and they can go ahead and use it as any other gift card. Uh, this is the kind of thing that uh, kind of works both ways. Whether they have it or not, they still get $40 worth of goodness. Now, I put links in the description to everything that I've talked about in the video to make it quick and easy for you to get to what you're uh, wanting to get to. Um, if you're a hacker type and you're thinking, hey, I want my friends and loved ones to see this before they buy me anything, particularly before they buy you something stupid that you actually don't really want, well, go ahead and send them a link to this video. Um, you know, happy shopping for your gifted hacker friends out there, and I'll see you in the next video.